Welcome back to the Purple Wall. My name's Mirage, and this is another nail polish review. Ooh. You guys can probably tell by all my other videos that I'm a bit fickle when it comes to my nails. And as I said before, I really just want to keep myself from biting them and being destructive because I've never in my entire life had long, luxurious nails. And it's not that I'm trying to go for that look. It's just that I would like a little bit of length in my nails. And I've, I'm a chewer. I'm a biter. I'm a eat them down to the nub type of girl. And for a really long time now, I've been able to keep them not stubby and short and gross and stuff. And I'm really proud of myself. So yay me! Anyway, back to the nail polish review. Uh, as you can tell, black, very elegant, very chic, very now. I decided to do black for, uh, just because I, I, there are a lot of colors, and to me, I mean, technically black isn't a color, but to me black is. And I thought it was very, it's, I love the way my nails look in black, and I guess it, I don't know if it's just because of my style, but I just think black is just such a nice, color for, I guess, me, and I love the way my nails look, my hands and my nails look particularly with black nail polish on. But anyway, we're not just going to talk about nail polish, we're going to talk about accent colors, and as you guys can see by my ring fingers, we have like a, kind of like a broken glass, maybe universe type of thing going on here and I do you know you guys know that I don't do it perfectly and and I've said before that when I I I trust that when I do my nails all of this like bad not perfect nail polish is going to rub off in the bed when I roll around or in the shower when I shower or when I do my hair and stuff like that so I don't worry about it and I don't really like going to the nail salon to do it because I, lo I I just can't live with one color on my nail for too long. I just can't. I'm really fickle about it. I like being spontaneous and I like a lot of variety. I literally have 30 vials of nail polish and I probably switch between colors each week. Like, I don't know, six colors for one week and that's probably... A an obsession that I'm developing, but that's not the point of this video. The point of the video is we're going to talk about accent colors and nails and the review of the color and blah blah blah. It I, it looks great. I love it. I used a Wet and Wild. I rubbed off <laughs> the. I use this a lot, so I rubbed off the the label. But it's Wet and Wild, and I got this at my local grocery store down the street around. Halloween time, and it's perfect. I couldn't, I mean, it's black, you guys. It is black nail polish. I can't tell you if it's got a number because everything's rubbed off, but you guys can find a good black. Wet and Wild in particular makes a good black, and I, I haven't found a black nail polish in my entire life that wasn't great, so... If I find one, I'll let you guys know. The next thing, I did two accent colors. I, or I, what I mean is I t did two accent color layers. I wanted to try this CoverGirl Outlast Stay Brilliant in 330. What color are you? Diva After Dark. How an appropriate name. That's such a nice name. And this stuff you guys can actually use. It's, it is a black, but it also has some glitter in it. And it's opaque enough that you can just use it as a black nail polish, but it'll just be glittery. So I use this as, I, I put two coats of black on the regular nails, and on the ring finger where I put my accent, I just put one layer of regular black, then the cover girl, because you don't want too many layers, and then finally, which I, 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 decided to start, I found this, it is Triple Shine by Sally Hansen, and I found this in my local grocery store as well, and I thought it looked really kind of cool, and I wanted to try it, and I haven't seen it, and I don't, I don't know if it's popular, or if it's, if it's new, or if it's old, but I found this, I've never seen it, so I decided to try it, 
And it's Sally Hansen Triple <laughs> It's Triple Shine by Sally Hansen. And it's 300 pearly whites and it's a glitter. And it's got a really cool cap that snaps on and snaps off. So, if you lose this, I'm guessing, I mean, this this goes on, like, with a snap. So, if you guys lose the brush, then it, it'll be fine because you can just snap that back on and I don't think it will dry out. And then it's just, it's literally just a glitter and... What I did to achieve this look on my nail is I made sure that it was, it wasn't too much, but it also wasn't too little. And basically what I did was instead of stroking it on, I dabbed it on and then stroked it around and stuff to achieve the kind of broken glass kind of look. I think it looks great. I like it. It's really nice. And... I will try to keep this on as, 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 as long as possible, but I went with black and a black glitter and a pearly whites, I believe. I said, yep, pearly whites to combine. I combined this on my accent, which I always use my ring finger only because that's just me. A lot of people use their thumbs, a lot of people use their pointer fingers, and I just use my ring finger and that's fine. That's just my choice. <laughs> so, uh, all right. So uh, that's today's, um, what are we talking about? I don't even know anymore. That's today's nail polish review. And I, I like them. Like I said, you guys can use this Color Girl Stay Brilliant for just a regular nail polish. And then just, I oh, I also put a top coat on, which you guys know what I use as a, Sally Hansen's uh, quick dry and I like it it's I like that it just quickly dries I do try to stay careful though with it for at least an hour or two just because you know just because it says quick dry doesn't mean that the layers underneath are dry yet but just be careful when you guys do paint your nails and just make sure that you wait I don't know. I would I would recommend waiting five to ten minutes between each layer before you put on another one. And yeah, you'll, you'll it looks good. So you guys, this is my nail polish review for this week, and I hope you like it. And I will see you tomorrow for something awesome. All right, bye guys.